So, you think you know hacking? Well, I've got news for you. Everything you think you know about hacking is probably wrong. Yeah, I said it. Stick with me for the next few minutes, because I'm going to break down the biggest misconceptions that are holding you back from becoming a true hacker. And trust me, once you understand these truths, your entire approach to hacking will change. By the end of this video, you'll know why most people get hacking completely wrong, why the way you've been learning could be slowing you down, and the real secrets that pro hackers use to stay ahead of the game. Plus, if you're serious about leveling up fast, I've got a special cheat sheet with all the most common tools and commands that hackers use. Stick around, I'll tell you how to grab it. Let's start with the biggest misconception out there. Hacking is all about using the right tools. Wrong. Look, tools are great, but they don't make you a hacker. Beginners often fall into the trap of downloading the latest tool, thinking it's going to solve all their problems. But here's the truth. Without the right mindset and problem-solving skills, those tools are just useless programs taking up space. Think about it. How many times have you seen someone fire up Enemap or Metasploit, but they have no clue what to do with the data? Real hackers think first, then choose their tools based on the situation. So if you're spending more time learning tools than understanding the why behind them, you're doing it wrong. And if you want a shortcut to mastering the most essential tools, I've put together a hacking cheat sheet that lists all the most common tools and commands that you need to know. It's a fast track for beginners and pros alike. Check out the link in the description to grab it. Next up, hacking isn't just about breaking into systems. This one's tricky because Hollywood has seriously messed with our expectations. You've seen the movies, one guy at a keyboard, furiously typing away and bam, he's in. But real hacking? It's so much more than that. Real hacking is about understanding systems at their deepest level. It's about knowing how things work so well that you can make them do things they weren't designed to do. That could mean exploiting a vulnerability, sure, but it also means preventing attacks, patching flaws, and securing data. If you think hacking is just about breaking in, you're missing 90% of the bigger picture. Now, I get it. You watch tutorials, you read blog posts, you might even follow along with walkthroughs. But here's a hard truth. Watching someone else hack doesn't make you a hacker. It's like watching a cooking show and expecting to become a master chef without ever touching a knife. You've got to get your hands dirty. The only way to really understand hacking is to do it. Set up your own lab, try things out, break things, and learn how to fix them. The real learning happens when you fail and figure out why you failed. So if you've been watching tutorial after tutorial without trying things on your own, it's time to change that. And hey, if you want to start with the basics, the cheat sheet I mentioned earlier is a great way to familiarize yourself with the core commands hackers use. It's quick, simple, and you can reference it whenever you need to. The link's in the description. Are any of these hitting close to home? If so, don't worry, you're not alone. Most people make these same mistakes when they start out, but by recognizing them now, you're already ahead of the game. And stick with me, because these next truths are the ones that pro hackers swear by. Here's something no one talks about. Speed. So many people think that to be a great hacker, you've got to move fast. You've got to crack the code in seconds, find the flaw instantly, and move like lightning. But the reality? Speed comes after mastery. If you're rushing through challenges or CTFs, you're probably missing important detail. Pro hackers take their time, analyze every step, and only move fast when they know exactly what they're doing. So, if you're focused on speed before you've mastered the fundamentals, you're playing it all wrong. And this brings us to the biggest truth of all. Hacking is not about finding exploits. It's about solving problems. You're not just searching for an opening. You're figuring out how things work, where the weaknesses are, and how you can manipulate the system to get your desired result. Think of hacking like a puzzle. The goal isn't just to solve it. The goal is to understand how all the pieces fit together. Pro hackers are great because they understand the systems they're hacking better than the people who built them. If you shift your focus from just finding vulnerabilities to understanding systems holistically, that's when you level up. So now that we've flipped your understanding of hacking on its head, let me ask you, how are you going to change the way you approach hacking from here? Drop a comment and let me know which one of these truths surprised you the most. And don't forget, if you want to master the tools and commands every hacker should know, check out my cheat sheet in the description. It's a simple, easy to use guide that'll save you hours of searching for the right commands when you need them most. If this video opened your eyes, hit that like button. It helps more people discover these tips. And if you want to keep learning the right way, hit that subscribe button because I've got more pro hacking strategies coming up that'll take your skills to the next level. Thanks for watching. And remember, hacking is more about what you understand than what you use. Keep pushing yourself, keep learning, and I'll see you in the next one.